What, what's it like for you this year as opposed to, you know, last season you still trying to find your way a little bit, you know, last year, later after the season you kind of get established and now you're kind of situated there as a man at right guard. Just what, what, what difference does it make for you? You know, I really don't think there's much of a difference. Um, I mean, there's still the great competition there was last year. Uh, everybody fighting to try to get on the bus. Um, so, you know, I think everybody's just trying to become a better person uh, on the field, off the field every day. And, you know, I think that's very similar to how we were last year, and I think that's how it's going to continue to be. What finally clicked for you last year, though? Um, I'll be honest with you, I really don't know, because, I mean, I felt, I felt like I did everything I could to get on the field uh, early in the year. And, you know, then whenever they just gave me my chance, I wanted to make the most of it. What did you think about, uh, you know, I think all of us just looked at you and physically and go, well, that's a tackle. And it, ended up, it ends up being a guard that you, that you finally break through. Do you feel like a guard yet? Or are you a tackle playing guard? Or? You know, it, it really doesn't even, I don't even think about it, honestly. I mean, I'm, I'm out there to do what they need me to do to uh, make our team the best that it can be. So, you know, wherever they want to put me, that's where I'll play. Yeah, it's uh, hard not to notice that you and Isaiah next to each other uh, make a pretty good wall. Right. <laughs> what's, uh, what's the, uh, 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 I mean, how can you guys take advantage of that? I mean, it, you know? You know, I mean, obviously we're both big and strong. Uh, you know, that right side can be something special uh, every day. We try to work on communication uh, with each other. You know, make sure one person knows what's going on just as good as the next does. So, uh, you know, I feel like as long as we continue to work together, you know, we can we can be unstoppable on the front five. And do you feel like you've gotten better this off season from when you started to play uh, late last year? Oh, absolutely. I mean, our off season conditioning program and everything like that. You know, I mean, you have no option but to get better with the way that we've been working all winter, all summer. So. Uh, Absolutely. I think every guy on the team has improved uh, drastically from where they were last spring and even last fall. What in particular did you want to work on? I definitely play with my hands and pass protection better. Um, you know, I feel like that's something I went out and worked on every single day. And, uh, I mean, I, f I feel like it's paying off now. You were 17 when you first got on campus, is that correct? That's right. How difficult was that being that young, being kind of thrust into that kind of situation when we got older and experienced and, and all that? You know, it made you grow up fast, uh, but that was something I was kind of expecting, you know, walking yeah. in here. Um, so I knew I knew what was in store for me, so I just wanted to make the most of it. Are you on any special teams units? Uh, the punch shield. Were you on any last year? Mm, punch shield as well. Punch shield as well last year. I, I just want to ask you this. They've been replaying that title mm. game over and over. I just wonder, as a guy on the team, do you stop and watch, or is that something you, do, you don't even want to see when it's being replayed on TV? You know, we st I, feel, I stop and watch it. You know, I like to go back and, you know, see everything. And You know, special teams are one of the biggest parts of our team, and, you know, that was one of the biggest differences between Coach Smart's first year and his second year here was just, you know, the difference in special teams, guys buying into it, wanting to be a part of it. So, uh you know, I feel like guys continue to buy into that more and more every single day, and it's going to do nothing but make us better. You guys had a, a, a pump block in there. Did, does everybody, did everybody watch the slow-mo when you guys reviewed that? Was that something everybody looked at and said, boy, that, that pump block, our guy wasn't on sides there. Is that something everybody I, you know, wrote? I think that's something everybody said. But, uh, you know, it's, it's in the past. You know, we're not going to dwell on that. So we'll keep moving on. Yeah, what do you mean? that punch shield, I mean, big guy, you kind of jones him for that first tackle. <laughs> You know, I just hope that whenever it comes to make a tackle in open field on somebody that weighs 200 pounds less than I do, I hope I don't get embarrassed. <laughs> What's your impressions of Camarda being a freshman coming in and maybe having to, you know, do that job? You know, I feel like he can handle it very well. Um, I know all the specialists have been, have been working really hard uh, all summer, all off season. So, you know, I have no doubt in any of our specialists. You were what? talking a minute ago about growing up fast. Obviously, that was the challenge for Jake Fromm. Mm -hmm. What are the differences you see for him having that year under his belt? Especially? You know, he's he's got more confidence than anybody I've ever seen at the quarterback position. Um, you know, he's very vocal, knows knows all the checks, and that he knows what needs to be done. So our whole offensive line has faith in him to make the right calls, get us where we needed to be. So, uh, you know, I, he knows that he controls our offense and he can get us to do what he needs to be done. Is there ever a moment where he's kind of like hesitant or maybe like, Oh no, that's not what I meant. Or, or I mean, is he, is he ever Absol into something? Abs absolutely not. He he makes a call, and we make him right. That's the, I mean, that's what we're put out there to do.